right, we're checking out the only game that violently slaps physics across the face. It's Jelly Car. Say hello to the Yeet Mobile. The Yeet Mobile, besides having fantastic tires and a great paint job, has the ability to, for some reason, squish itself into places that shouldn't even be at all possible, such as this. Yep, that is happening. And for some reason, it can still maneuver. So while it squishes down into a fine toothpaste-like vehicle of sadness, we have to figure out how to go through all of the different challenges that these boards have, such as violently churning lime slices. Do you like citrus? Do you like citrus that tries to murder you? You? As you can see, our vehicle will make it through effectively any tiny crack, just like a rat. By following the errors, we can get to the end goal and go to the next level. See this right here? Does it look safe? Is it safe? No, it's not. Now, fortunately, getting to the next level is easy. I'm not gonna lie, anytime I get into any level in any game, I always want to know if there's a way to get out. There is not. All right. Guess I've got to do the challenge as it's made. Do I need to follow the different pathways or can I go past them? That is a very incredible ramp thing. I have no idea what to even call it. Yeet is! Full backflip, double backflip, triple backflip. There it is. As you can see, damage isn't a problem because we're made out of sad matter. It's like dark matter, only bouncier. I do appreciate that some random extra is doing all of the sound effects for this game. Got it. So far, I'm not going to lie. The challenges aren't that bad. I'm expecting something harsher. In order to give Gray the proper level of agony, you have to make it so that I can't complete a board unless I go mostly insane. I'm not even slightly insane. Oh, am I supposed to jump that? How are you supposed to get from one part to the other? Uh, do I just fall here or... I feel like I'm about to die. Yep, totally died. So apparently you have to jump your car into the cauldron of depression. Okay, so you cannot make this. There's no way, but that's fine. Because there is a cauldron down here that you can bloop into. I assume you knock over this sad stick. It's kind of like a uh, like a dollar store version of a cucumber. Uh, Am I supposed to touch that or does touching that murder me? Anytime I see something, that looks like it may be valuable. I am concerned that it will kill me. Wow. Let's try it. Got it! Don't know what that means. Secret exit. You found your first secret exit. There's one hidden in every level. See how many you can find. I don't like puzzles! Okay, so now the world opens up slightly more, and I get to go to 1-4. I like how it says find the end, but you don't actually need to find the end. You can find the lying end. And the lying end is better than the real end. All right, so beat the French fry to death. Very good. Let me go over the rope bridge of certain vehicular homicide. Okay. How many horsepower is this car? So it sounds like it's... What? Oh, what the... What does this do? What, do I have to do, like, mathematics or something? Oh! Okay. So you have to sit here until the bridge goes down. I have to wait, I have to wait, I have to wait, and then hope that I can get there in time before the bridge... Not today, Satan! Boring. Okay, so... Whoa! I cannot believe that I managed to survive. What did I get? I got like a slice of rancid cheese. I guess... Rancid cheese will bring you to the success. The game is like, oh great, you found grape flavored confusion. I love confusion. All right, find the end that you actually don't need to find. You got it. My car has 200 yeet power. Can I go up top or do I have to go down or? How does this even work? I can like squeeze my way through this. These tires, they're... <laughs> Their tread is incredible. Okay, so grab the, as I say, the confusing grape. I still don't know what that does. Pass the lime slices of destitution. Well, that was a lot easier than you'd think. Oh, wait, maybe it's not. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, never mind. The lime slice is violating me a lot. Like, where do I go after I complete all these? Does this do anything? 
Is it eventually going to give me a pat on the back, or is it just going to slap me across the face? Okay, so now you have a incredibly large crusher. Am I supposed to sit here, or do I just let this compress my spine until it comes out of my rectum? Where do you even fit through here? Oh, okay, so now you're supposed to go on top of the lifty thing. Got it. Pass the lifty thing onto the shelf. This looks like... Ooh, it's like volatile bacon. Volatile bacon, go! Hit me, bacon! Oh, wow, okay, so you have to fly way to the right. Easy. Okay, so now if you're gonna keep going, you have to get past the eggplants, then you have to fire off of the lemon slices. Then you have to head up to the pineapples of, I don't know, I don't even know what you call these. They're like very, very face stabby pineapples. Okay, so the nut turns this way, go out through the nut. Wow, this is a very elaborate board. Like this is a freakishly elaborate board. Why do I have to do all this? That's a lot of lime slices. All right, so I assume I have to fall down here. Fall down. Then you have to squeeze the lime out. Well, instead of squeezing the lime out, the lime kind of squeezes you out, like so. You have to go over this, then over the- Oh, stop, stop, no, yes, everything is fine. No big deal. No! We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay, so now on top of the pineapple. I don't know why everything is fruit based. It just kind of makes sense at the time. It's like maybe it's star fruit. Maybe that's the appropriate way to describe this. I, the fact that you have to do about 700 different things to find the way to the end of the exit is a bit concerning. Especially since I'm only on level one. Next level. Okay, so now we go backwards. Couple of face slaps. No big deal. Get violated a lot. I am so, oh my God. What is this challenge? Okay, so effectively you have to stay on top of the volatile eggplant without falling off or you die. So we have to follow this, follow this, follow this. All the shapes are trying to murder you the entire time. That's great. I love how it's like, hey Gray, flip or rotate the car. Yeah, I get it. God, everything is using gravity and I hate gravity. Okay, this is good, this is good, this is good. I'm I'm caught, I'm caught, perfect, perfect. Yeah, 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 here we go, yeah. Okay, and then you just fall down. No! I hate that I have to, in a very, very controlled manner, fall to my death. Okay. So line it up and then fall to your death this way. Got it. I've never had a game say to me, hey, Gray, you need to fall to your death, but you need to fall to your death exactly like this. Oh, I got a jump ability. Yeah, it Oh, wow. I turned into a monster truck. Oh, uh, that's kind of cool. Wow, thanks for showing me the pain I have to go through. So now I have the ability to turn instantly much bigger if I need to. Sure, let's do it. Wow, this is exactly like every single YouTube thumbnail I've ever seen. Green grass, lava, right there. It's kind of like a very fluffy lava. So now become big, then you can climb up this roadway, then you can squish down because like I said, physics has no boundaries here. So you have to do this in like one shot, literally one shot. So make it big. Climb up, go down, squeegee through the, come on, squeegee through the, really? Oh, you can control the amount that you go up. Okay, so up, small, and then big. Ah, I've got it now. Gotcha. So speed over this. Okay, or I could just get bigger and go over that way, then small. Now we go through the jaws of certain death. Let me go ahead and break my back over all these. It's fine, though. Okay, so now I have to climb the jaws, but I can get very big should I need to. Couple front flips. <laughs> very normal. No, I got stuck. So you have to be full size in order to have any chance of doing this. Go. Go. Come on. I don't have time. No. Yay. Ice cubes of compaction. Ow. Ugh. 
I'm just getting violated by every color scheme known to this game. Okay, so now the ground sometimes becomes smooth and sometimes becomes jagged. So now the ground changes. Are you kidding me? No. Okay, stop, 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 stop. 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 Don't go all the way back to no. Okay, jump. Okay, stop, 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 stop. 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 There. Stop. Yes. Perfect. I've never had an instance where I had to manipulate both the board and my car. Ah! Oh my god! Oh! Got it. So at this point now, the endings are feeling like you're legitimately having to- Oh, 316. The endings are feeling like you're legitimately supposed to use some level of mental capacity to do this. I don't have a lot of mental capacity to- Capacitize. We're gonna have to wow. use my skill just to get to the next level. Maybe this one won't be that bad. Hey, okay, squish through here. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is happening. Oh, hold on. <laughs> okay, it almost happened in a way that would kill me. Okay, this car is less like jelly and more like something that both doesn't have friction and doesn't deal with gravity in a way that any normal vehicle does or any substance known to mankind. The Yeet Mobile is continuing to gain both power and agility. Go into the Pac-Man, very sad. Get the purple, I don't really know what the purple thing is, but I kind of feel like I need it. There it is. Go onto this, no! Wait, everything's fine, everything's fine. No! <laughs> oh, I know what to do, okay. So I have to wait until this thing goes up and I basically have to jump this, jump on here, land on here before it goes down. Now I'm getting seasick. Grab the end. All right, Yeetmobile. You're doing great. The Yeetmobile's like, I want to die. That's perfect. That's how you know you're winning. Those who cannot endure pain cannot succeed through the gears. Ow. Yes. Okay, so I can't go to the left because then I will die. I have to go to the right. I don't need to be a big car. I can just kind of like, well, maybe I do need to be a big car. All right, big car it is. Squish me, small car. Okay. Through here. Onto the edge. Got plenty of traction. Full flip. Through the gears. Oh yeah, this is happening. Oh, I got the idea now. I'm glad that there's I'm glad that there's arrows too, because if there wasn't, I really wouldn't know what to do right now. Although right now I'm just getting my colon shoved out of my esophagus. If you don't know where those body parts are, just know that it's bad if that were to happen to you suddenly. Okay, so we're gonna go up top. I don't have the grip to continue, so I have to use this giant vehicle in order to get up here, then turn small. Whoa! I need to hide! Inside of the cogs. Okay, that's cool. Are these are these bacons good or are they bad? If I touch these bacons, will they kill me? Let's find out. Oh! Whoa! The bacon was a lie! Alright, lying bacon. I will remember you for all times after you tried to like betray me. I love how there is an arrow pointing me to go this way when I don't think that there's another way I could go. I'm gonna fall down here just to see what happens. It's death. Wait a minute. Hold on. Are you lying to me? Is there like a little hidden area down here? Hold on. I'm gonna slide off this. Wait for it. Then we're gonna lean. No, you can't grab that at all. All right. Guess I'm going straight. Yeah, this. Uh. Okay. Sure. Up top. Get blasticated. Whoa. All right. It goes into a defined area. How are you supposed to do this? All right. I have an idea. Here's the plan. We're gonna grab this. We're gonna turn big. It's gonna shoot. Yes, there we go. Okay, I got it. Now you squeeze under here and now I get to ride the gigantic volatile meatball. So meatball, boing, grab it, small, perfect. Now I have every single type of like pepper and onion going to grind my vehicle into non-existence, but I guess we just have to let this happen. Here we go. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh no, go back down to that! Oh, I got the I got the purple thing. Where are you supposed to go here? I have no Oh Okay. So then increase the size, it shoots the meatball. Uh-huh. Keep going. Keep going, meatball. Oh, I don't have I don't have the strength. 
I'm missing all of my strength and size. You can do it. No! Hold on. Oh, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Do it. No! I, all, I thought I was going to die, but in fact, I actually just saved myself. All right, climb over the meatball, then push the other meatball. Got it! I feel like everything is getting faster and a lot more drunk. Okay. I'm just being kicked like a soccer ball to the next level. I feel like the more colorful the boards are, the more... Whoa! Okay. And then, whoa! Oh, I don't have enough. S okay, I'm, we're good. We're fine. We're fine. <laughs> Perfect. I even have a little bit more size left. Okay, so stay small. Then we go here. I don't really know what this does. Oh, you have to b get big, maybe? I guess we're going to stay big. Oh, it activates this. Okay. So maintain, maintain, maintain. Then small. Jump off. All of the different citrus slices pummel you to death. It's fine though. Ah, six to the landing. Grab. Big. Ah. Interestingly enough, you have to use your size transference to get distance. There we go. Well, I have to do this more than once. You're thinking, Way too highly of me. Last try, if I mess this up, it's like back to the bottom. Go! Perfect. And now with the big size, we can... Oh, you have to do a jump in order to get this. And I'm almost out of helium or whatever you want to call this. Yeetium. That's a good... That's a good periodic table element. Yeetium! Crush my soul. Please. Go. Do it. I didn't need that soul anyway. Yep, feels great. Great. This is basically like a, uh, oh, what the? Okay. And then go off here? Yeah, that worked out pretty good. I was about to say, that was basically like a Funyun trying to transfer me to the next board. Why is there a skull at the end? Now I'm curious what the skull means. Oh, I'm, I get to be murdered by different gems from Minecraft. Out of the way, gems. Well, the gems aren't that bad. Okay. So I have to balance my car on these. Full front flip, no big deal. I'm totally dead now. Never mind. I'm totally fine. Yeetus! Grab the yeetium. Ah, see, look at this. I can't outrun this. Notice that? Or can I? <laughs> okay, so now I have to wait for this to come down. As soon as it comes down, you get big so that you get stuck inside of it. Hopefully you're not claustrophobic while this is happening. This is unbelievably difficult to do because you need to go from small to big inside of the Funyun. Meanwhile, the Funyun is like valiantly trying to slap you across the face. So we're gonna want to go across this grab all of these grape flavored whatever they are. Oh, I, I have to go this way. Okay, all right. I'll go upward. I, I trust you. I trust you. It's fine. What could possibly go wrong? And then big size. Get slurped. It oh, okay. Getting slurped up here is not easy. Never thought I would treat myself as some kind of slushy. Up. There we go. Almost went out of the board. Got it. All right. I'm getting close to murder. All right. Go on top of the bow tie pasta. I love how everything is edible. Okay. All right. This looks what? fine. That was a large marshmallow trying to kill me. Uh, am I supposed to do something? Or... I feel like I'm supposed to. Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. So I need to leave this piece of miso soup, this tofu on here. I need to climb the tofu. There we go. Perfect. Now I can go up here. Go past the lemon slice over to the cucumber conveyor belt. Okay, this cucumber is moving very, very quickly. Then, I don't know, get up here somehow? Maybe down here? So that brings the tofu down this way. I need it to come all the way down, though. All right, so I need to come up, and I think I need to slap the tofu down the rest of the way. Here we go. Push the tofu. Okay, the tofu is not behaving. Oh, I need to bring the tofu the other direction. You and me are going to be fantastic friends, tofu. Now sit here. Trust me on this. Stop. Stop it. Let go. Stop touching me. Just, just sit there. Go. 
Boing. 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 Hello. Boing. Perfect. I don't like things that challenge Boing. my mental capacity. Stop Boing. it. Got it. Two levels left until I get to ultimate demon land. Boing. Oh, I'm ready. All right, drive on top of Boing. the chicken nuggets Boing. over here. Flop Boing. down the side, over through wow. Canada. Boing. Go through the icy realm of the wow. Canadian wilderness. Oh. Then I have to go on here. Wait until that goes up. Go, 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 go. Nope. Boing. Uh, I don't know. I guess just kind of flop down the the very limp Boing. zucchini. Yeah, Boing. that worked out well. Boing. I oh Boing. oh. Okay, go, go, go. Zucchini. Boing. Perfect. I need to hit Boing. this meatball Boing. over like that. Boing. The meatball falls to the other side. Okay, so I need to get down and get past that little area before this falls. This is unbelievably difficult. Boing. Like, can I even Boing. fit past this meatball? Boing. Oh, maybe Boing. I can. Boing. Okay, okay meatball, go, go. Boing. I need you to go back this way. Go. There we go. <laughs> Got it. Ow! Oh, yeah. Oh, I love vehicular spinal compression. Ah! <laughs> Have a certain amount of time before the ceiling caves in. Ah, purple. I love. I love purple. Orange slices of destiny. Go! Oh, it's still following me. I had no idea. Ah! I. I burned away so much time. I should have so much more time, but I screwed this up. I cannot believe I made that. Oh, it's like. Uh, it's like eggplant juice. The time has come. Time to drink the skulls. Oh, I have a balloon ability now. Okay. Steer the balloon. I'm not really good at steering. <laughs> Don't ask me why I play vehicle games when I'm terrible at steering. Oh, and that's it. That's how you do it. I beat the double level. That means... I get to die even harder, I guess, and going up if I want. I want to know what death feels like. I just got violated by a by a cloud. Why are even the cloud? Oh my god. Okay, this is the fastest level I've played so far. I never thought that a cloud would try and, you know, leg drop me to death. So now I have to use my balloon, push this up, get past it, turn off my balloon, get the next balloon. Then balloon my way through the maze of the Minotaur. <laughs> okay. Turn the balloon off. Fall down. More balloon. If I mess this up, I will get grinded very, very smoothly. I can feel part of my jelly car catching onto this, and it doesn't feel like something I should attempt to do on purpose. Give me the balloon! Ah, oh, you need to travel across the chasm. So through the chasm. No! How are, you, how are you supposed to get through the chasm? Oh, you have to do it a little bit at a time? Yep. This is this is insane. Got it! So now I have finally learned how to properly inhale helium balloons! Well, I did the jelly car challenge, and it is way more involved than I would have ever thought. Hey anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of Jelly Car. Till the next time, stay foxy and much love.